हाय एवरीवन वेलकम टू एन डी वी एडुकेशनल यूट्यूब चैनल टुडे आई एम स्टार्टिंग पाइथन सीरीज इन हैकर रैंक द मेन ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ दिस पाइथन सीरीज वाज टू डिलीवर पाइथन कंटेंट फ्रॉम ए वेरी इजी लेवल्स टू डिफिकल्ट लेवल्स सो दैट एवरीवन कैन बी एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड पाइथन प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेज ईजीली एंड एफेक्टिवली इन दिस इंट्रोडक्शन वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन हाउ टू लर्न पाइथन ईजीली For that, I am suggesting one easy and important method to learn Python perfectly. The method was hacker rank. Here, why I am suggesting hacker rank was we do have lot of advantages present in hacker rank itself, and I would like to explain three most useful and important advantages present in hacker rank itself. First one was uh, we have lot of programs present in hacker rank. from easy levels to difficult levels that helps us to practice our one from easy levels and understanding easily and second one is we have a facility to practice all of the those programs in hacker rank itself in this right side of the screen we can able to see the white space right this white in this white space this white space is called python online editor in this python online editor we can able to practice our programs and while practicing only we can perfect in our programming language and third important thing is uh, hacker rank provides uniform uh, consistent simple and understandable program requirement follows here the program requirement uh, format looks like first they provided a program requirement and follows by a example which relates to to the program and followed by input format output format sample input and sample output here they didn't provide any sam sample input because uh, for this program uh, itself we don't have any requirement for the input in coming programs we have requirement to take uh, input and according to that input we need to take uh, we need to print uh, our output this is the easy program right easy level program right so here they directly uh, ask the requirement like just only print the string value this is the only requirement so before uh, explaining this program i want to highlight three things um i will explain those three things uh, in every program in coming videos also in different note in this program i will i will suggest three important things to uh, remember first one is we need to remember syntax and second one is we need to practice programs then only we can able to perfect uh, in our programming language third thing is we need to understanding the program requirement perfectly then only we can able to write our code correctly here first one i suggested write uh, to remember syntax uh, we can't able to remember syntax one at a time we can able to remember the syntax two ways one is we can understand the syntax program by program by program from easy level programs to difficult level program that is one way and another way is Uh, while practicing, we le we let us know that this is the correct syntax we need to uh, use like this, and this is the wrong syntax we can't uh, use syntax like that. That is the main advantage of practice. And while practicing, uh, we have a lot of advantages like uh, remembering syntax. And second most important advantage is we can able to write our code uh, in different ways. We can. and our code not restricted to one way to code like this only like that only not, not like that we can develop our code uh, multiple ways according to the requirement this is the use of rec program rec uh, practice and third one as i uh, highlighted after understanding the program requirement uh, perfectly only we can able to write or develop our code correctly these are the three things i want to be um uh, remember you all before starting the program or while learning the any programming language 
and coming to this uh, program requ program requirement here they provided uh, a pro program requirement so i will read this here is a sample line of code that can be executed in in python this is the prog program requirement uh, since this is the easy level program they just ask us uh, this is the sample line of the sample line of code this is the sample line of code and then want us to execute it in python so they ask us to try to execute this sample line whether it is executed or not so i will copy this directly and i paste it in uh, right side of the python online editor i will try to execute this whether it is executed or not first i will run this code in running time we have some test cases and while executing our code that time we might have more test cases comparing to the runtime code here uh, we have advantage to check what is uh, if any um, compilation er error or any error came that time we uh, we can check what is our input uh, what is our output came what need to be changed according to the expected output that thing uh, that is ad extra advantage thing in the online compiler so i will copy this sample line directly i will run uh, this is executed so i will uh, submit this code whether it is executed or not so here also executed it, it simply shows a uh, success message in compiler in this way we can uh, execute our pro execute our code according to the program requirement here uh, i will show another way to uh, to achieve this program requirement because we can't restricted uh, one way to write code code only like this or like that that is not a correct method so we can write our code any uh, different ways this is one method and uh, i want to highlight one thing also python is case sensitive and that may getting um, through some errors while we not using our our Uh, syntax correctly or we, if we make any um, sensitive uh, mistakes so i will show here instead of capital h i will i did take small h here so i will try to run code here uh, it simply shows wrong answer sample test case uh, not executed uh, by showing a red color here um, our output displayed hello world here also expected output displayed both meaning are same hello world hello world but the thing is this one our output was not matched because here capital h is there here small h is there this was the uh, difference and i want to uh, please remember i will uh, i highlight some important things while developing code also here we can use as as symbol by disabling our code because by simply disabling this line if we, if it rep, uh, requires i will use after developing uh, my remaining code if it not requires this is not problem to execute remaining code please remember that point so i will take a different way i will take this as a second method because here my string is there this is the uh, variable name here uh, all needs to be remember one thing variable plays a key role in python programming language or any program programming language because variable main uh, purpose is we can store any values like integer value uh, float value here the string value like this we can store any integer value uh, any values here they take in uh, string uh, variable name as my string i will take instead of this i will take directly a as my variable name so i will print variable name instead of printing this thing i will store this thing in some variable i will print that variable so i will take a as variable while taking any variable we can't we can't uh, um, need to use double quotes if you use any double quote that shows error or or that directly print uh, within the double quote uh, presented content so whenever we want to 
print the variable we can directly take without any quotes because as per program requirement we can follow like that if can't if you are unable to understand things please repeat uh, watch the watch the video repeatedly because in while printing the variable we can't use the double quotes this is the point please remember that so i will run this code once so this also executed in this way we can uh, executed any program in different ways if any doubts please ping in the comment section and thanks for watching thank you for supporting thank you all